Everybody was in the car, then Tori walked in. They all drunk already, mind you. I'm outside, my weapon is in the car. Tori and Meg get to arguing. Kylie's outside at the pool still. Tori and uh, the girl in the car start arguing. Meg walk out because she find out such and such. Tori been messing with both of the women in the car. You know how that go already, Tori got in trouble. Meg hops out the car. Tori and the girl fighting over the gun. Excuse me. Tori and the girl fighting over the gun. The gun accidentally goes off. Cause Tori the gun. He's trying to shoot Megan. The gun accidentally goes off in the midst of them fighting for it. And the girl shoots. And the bullet accidentally gets near Megan. That's why it didn't hit no tendon. So there you have it, folks. There's the whole case right there. The bodyguard tells the truth, explains the whole story, and then comes up missing. Allegedly. Now, I'm going to tell you my opinion on it. Both of these bitches is lying. They trying to keep it gangster like a dude would keep it like like a dude would be like, fuck a bitch. You know what I'm saying? It's money over a bitch. We're not going down for no for no bitches. I think these dudes are trying to, I mean, I think they trying to say, we ain't going out like this for no dude. We just going to blame it on the dude. And I think they trying to keep it all the way pimping. Um, you hear them say the girl shot him. Only someone would shoot someone out of emotions like that when they find, when they find out embarrassing news like that. Two, Megan, allegedly, Megan a Stallion was paying, uh, I can't remember her name, the friend's name, just paying her rent for a whole year. So that would clearly let you know that the woman, her friend, is financially disabled and, and going to say whatever she got to say to keep her back. And guess what? Megan is the back. So she probably got to deal with her like, listen. Let's blame it all on him, and I'll give you a meal after it's all said and done. Meanwhile, he's facing 23 years. That's why you see uh, pictures with him and um, Jay Prince and them saying, save black men, because this seemed real shaky. It's your boy Cash Ola. I'm out.